What's up, everyone? Welcome back to the channel. Views from the 502. Ty, Ryan, Nick, back as always with another reaction. But first, if you would like to join the 502 crew, please give this video a thumbs up because it helps the channel grow and it helps us reach more people. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button. And also, hit that notification bell so you keep up with all our videos. Yeah. All right, guys. So, about a couple months back or so, we reacted to our first Boston song. Mm. And you guys loved it. Boston! Not yeah. Only, not only did I love it, <laughs> after uh, we reacted to it, I said, it's probably one of the best songs of all time. I'm I'm behind that. That might Ooh. be... That's a big statement. It might be on the gold list. Oh, oh that is on the gold yeah, list. Yeah, the gold yeah. list that we found out. Uh, yeah, not the gold list ago. that I didn't know existed. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, does exist. I need to see this list. Yeah, Ryan, what were your thoughts on Four Play Long Time? Oh, I liked it because I liked the dude's voice. The dude's voice yeah. was amazing. Uh, yeah, I knew you were gonna like that song. So. Yeah, I'm pretty sure before you played, you was like, "I think Ryan's gonna like this," and I did. Yeah, that song has everything. Yes, it's got it's got everything. It's got funk. It's got rock. It's got everything. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, even I was whenever I said you guys, I meant the viewers. They liked it too. Even though some of y'all thought I was a little obnoxious, I'm just saying I'm a little passionate about my Boston. Boston yeah. is one of my favorites. Yeah. And, uh, and one thing I learned, at least from the comments, is that Tom Scholes was really the one that made it all yeah. come together. Yeah. He, like, played everything. And, like, he did it at home or something? Yeah, in his basement. Nuts, man. That's I actually nice. uh, read the song that we're going to do today, which is More Than Feeling. Uh, he spent most of the time in his basement, like, yeah. writing this song. Yeah, that's crazy. And the guy that sings is fired. Brad Delpit passed away. It's yeah. sad because that man is a national treasure. Yeah. But uh, it was a tough choice. Yeah, it was. We just conversed on which one we should do. Yeah. <laughs> you like my words, Ryan? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, we and, conversed. Uh, we're not sure if Ryan has heard this or not because, again, yeah. this is one of those songs that it seems like everybody knows, but, you know. Yeah. We've had those before and Ryan didn't know. Yeah. So it's, it's just kind of a wait and see. Like we said, like a lot of these. Ryan doesn't know. When we do classic rock, a lot of them Ryan doesn't know. Metal, it's more of me and Ryan don't know them. But when we get into the uh, hip hop, it's Nick doesn't really know. It's, that's why we we, we like yeah. to bounce around to different genres on this yeah. channel. Yeah, so, but we're not even in our bag. No, yet. we're not even in our <laughs> bag at all, at all. But uh, yeah, this is just a song that we have to do. Yeah, you just have to do. You just have to. Do, yeah. yeah, it's heavily requested. Yeah, and it's also, is it their most successful song? It's possible. Yeah. yeah. That one it in Foreplay a long time yeah. is the Those biggest. Those two. Yeah, yeah, the biggest two. Yeah. So we're going to knock out both of them. That's right. So we wanted to give, uh, you know, another reaction for the Boston fans. Yeah. And same album. Yeah, same album. That album is. Oh. That's a gold-listed album. Another thing. It's gold-listed. We didn't even know when we were sitting there. Looking at the album cover. Oh yeah, uh, we said it was UFOs. Yeah. Well, that's just which at it first is. Glance. It's a yeah. Yeah, but it's, it's guitars though. Yeah, it's guitars. And everybody was telling us that. So yeah, yeah we found out after the uh, first comment. Yeah. But yeah. Uh, still, we love it when you guys give us the feedback, and that makes the album cover even cooler to me. Yeah. Because I never saw that before. There was even people saying that they never saw it before. And they're, you know, in yeah, their 50s exactly. and 60s. Exactly. So it's pretty crazy. And we had that iconic moment where we even said the song <laughs> sounded like the freaking UFO was coming down. So it just, yeah. it all sounds together, you know, it yeah. makes sense. Yeah. So we're going to get back into some Boston today. And today we are doing More Than a Feeling. So let's get right into this thing. Boston, More Than a Feeling. Oh, yes. That rim shot. Turn off the music to start my day. I've lost myself in the middle of the song. I close my eyes and I slipped away. Oh, <laughs> 
It's just a feel good song, boy. It really is. Just, just makes you happy. It's like somebody giving you a warm hug. It really is. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so does this sound familiar at all? I've heard the chorus. The yeah. chorus always gives it away. Yeah. I'm telling you right now. You hear now. a lot of choruses, Ryan, don't you? Probably from a lot of movies I watch. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Um, but it's still going to be a reaction, though, yeah. because he has not heard the song. In this totality. Exactly. So, uh, yeah, this is, I mean, come on. Listen to his voice. It's just, it's so soft and nice and smooth, yes. man. And all the instruments shine in their own way. Yeah. You can clearly hear, like, everything. It's what, so good. What did you call the instrument in the beginning? The little... I don't even know what it was. <laughs> oh, that was a rim shot. That's what it's called, yeah. a rim well, shot. Well, that was okay. a snare drum. It was a regular yeah, drum. It's oh, just, just a certain way that you hit the drum. Oh, okay. And, uh, it's got rim shots. I like it because, you know, in a lot of songs like this, bands won't kind of mix up the drums. It's For some reason, it's like they're afraid. Yeah. I don't know why, but I like how the drums are giving this a little bit of flavor. Yes. You know? It's like, yeah, this is a soft song, but we're still a rock band. Yes. You know, I still got to do my thing. So. Don't forget. Don't forget. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, the chorus is just, I mean, come on. Who is Marmarian, by the way? Or Mararian? What did he say? Mararian? <laughs> did you turn into Ryan? Marmarian. <laughs> it's Marianne. Well, I, I can't really hear that. I'm reading the lyrics and... Marianne. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, really. I'm, I'm, who, I'm just wondering who it is. <laughs> who is Marianne? <laughs> Is that his wife? <laughs> Remember? <laughs> oh, my goodness. Um, yeah, I, I, just, I just want to know who Mary It's Mary Ann. Hey, he never lets us down, man. Mary Ann. <laughs> <laughs> he said Mary Ann. <laughs> my Mary <Marian>. Ann. <laughs> I was confused there. <laughs> yeah. We'll, we'll get more into the lyrics, but yeah, the chorus is just so good. Yes, it is great. Yeah, I like that. I like the tan, 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 just the repetitive. Yeah, yeah. And uh, if you've ever heard uh, Nirvana's "Smells Like Teen Spirit," that uh, riff they use in that song kind of reminds me of this one. Dun, 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 you know, it's it's yeah. similar. I just think it's similar. So it is similar. Yeah, this is just great though. But this was first. Yeah, let's get back to it. <laughs>
end <laughs> isn't that isn't that like the dun, 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 is that using a, a show like an intro maybe that um, what I said about, about what I said about Nirvana it sounds similar to yeah there's the, a the lot of songs word. that kind of have that sound yeah dun, 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 dun. yeah 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 that's probably what it is yeah but uh yeah that's I Come actually on. saw a connotation on that screen that we're looking at. Yeah. At uh, Marion. Yeah. Was a girl that he used to know that was the most beautiful girl in the world. Yeah. That's uh, so it makes sense. Really sweet. I just yeah. wanted to know who Marion was. Yeah. And it appears that uh, it, it, he it was just when he was a kid when he was like eight or nine. Yeah. You know. So uh, sweet has a good meaning behind it. <laughs> yeah. I just there's a I love the uh, kind of freedom. That this song brings. I yes. Mean, if this song doesn't put a smile on your face, cheers you up, you know, you probably have no soul. I mean, really. This is the type of song you just turn on in the car, roll the windows down, just go down a, a road. Yeah, and I can see how this appeals to the masses because uh, even though it's a feel good song and it's catchy and all that, uh, it still rocks, though. Mm-hmm. It still rocks. Yeah, I really love the Boston with the little, where they slide the yeah. guitar. And there was, was a, there was another part in there that reminded me of foreplay a long time when it went, da na na, you know. It was yeah. kind of another part like that, you know. It's just that big theatrical sound that I love about Boston. So, yeah, Ryan. Yeah, I definitely liked it in its a uh, totality. Oh, yeah. Than just the chorus. Yeah. Yes. So it's a very good song. Yeah. And like I said, the guy's voice is amazing. It is yeah. a great voice. That's crazy how you can hit one note and then go <laughs> higher. And it's like, yeah. how are you even up there? Because that's just way too high for. Yeah. Him. Like I, like I said, like I've been saying, for guys, it is not easy to sing yes, high. Yes. It is not meant for guys to sing high. And to do that is amazing. Yeah. Yes. It's like he was uh, singing at the concert. <laughs> and then, like, all of a sudden, he just, like, started walking out. But he was holding the note <laughs> yeah. as he was yeah, walking out. Like, <laughs> you know, just waving by to everybody. So, yeah, man. That's a classic. It's a classic. Instant classic. Yeah. So, yeah, definitely going to get back to Boston. Oh. They're uh, coming back. Matter of fact, uh, give us songs that... Um, that's Low-key. Yeah, they don't have to necessarily be unpopular, but just give us some um, unknown Boston underrated. songs. Underrated. Yeah, yeah, underrated or kind of deep cuts. Uh, give us some of that. Maybe some hidden gems. That we don't yeah, know. because I think that I've only heard... The uncut uh, gems. I've only <laughs> heard the songs from this album. Yeah. It's all from Boston. Yeah. So what else do they have? Let us know. Bring it to the table. So, yeah. Another uh, 10 out of 10 from Boston. For oh, me. Yeah. oh, yes. So, loved it. That is the end of the video, guys. Please tell us what you thought about that song. We love hearing your feedback. Please tell us your views. Thank you for subscribing and hit that notification bell. Peace, Peace out. out.